A crucial point for Beyond Epica has been the choice of the place to set the camp. The correct selection of the location for the drilling operations took three years with a dedicated part of the project. From 2016 to 2019, scientists and logistics work hard to scan and evaluate the best place to set the camp. It was the CSA project. The exact point for the drilling operations was called Little Dome C. Here, after long and accurate analysis, scientists found well-preserved and regular layers of Antarctic ice, from younger to older, for almost three kilometers of depth. In a few years, a small and simple temporary camp, not so far from Concordia Station, has been settled up with a few sleeping tents, some recovery units for instrumentation, and a big drilling tent. It occupies most of the camp, and it hosts the most important element of the project, the driller. Thanks to this driller, we have reached 130 meters of drill in the Antarctic ice cap. In this 2021-2022 drilling season, during the following season, we will go further. We expect to find ice which is 800,000 years old at a depth of 2,450 meters below the surface. We found that age by transferring the age we know from the Epica ice core at Dom Concordia to this new site tracing it along so-called internal reflections in the ice which we could image with radars because these internal reflections are often created by volcanic eruptions and then you have the volcanic material at the surface and goes slowly down and radar can image that. So once we have the age at one side we can transfer to the other age, uh, the other side. The problem is that we do not see all the way down so the deepest layer we see is around 450,000 years old and if we are a little bit optimistic we can say 6,000 years and below that depth we use some knowledge about how the ice deforms with depth so we extrapolate the age by using a simple mathematical model which is the so-called thinning function of the ice. 